The Congress on Tuesday announced the names of candidates for 12 of the 14 Lok Sabha seats in Assam, leaving two for its allies. Party leader Gaurav Kokoi, whose Kaliabor constituency was scrapped in the delimitation exercise, will fight balls from the Jorhat seat. However, Jorhat is a stronghold for the BJP, had won from the constituency in the last two Lok Sabha elections. It is believed that Gogoi, son of former Chief Minister Tarun Gogoi, was keen to fight balls from Nagaon, but its sitting Congress MP, Bradyut Bordoloi, had been opposing his candidature and insisted that as he won the seat with a good margin in 2019, he must be fielded again from there. Gaurav Kogoi was warmly welcomed by Congress members at Rajiv Pawan in Guwahati on Wednesday evening. Speaking to media, Kogoi said he was very happy with the list of candidates, adding that the Mahila Congress State President, the State President of the Seva Dal, General Secretary of the District Congress Committee, all three have found space. Today, today Congress or Delhi <laughs> Ujoni Hok, Namoni Hok, Promopotro Hok, Barak Hok, Congress goes to Hokti Ali Korebole, Very happy with the list of candidates. I feel we have put some of our best candidates uh, in the uh, in the candidate list. I'm glad that the organization have have found space. Uh, the Mahila Congress State President, the State President of the Seva Dal, the General Secretary of a District Congress, all three uh, have found space, as well as we have uh, allowed some leading intellectuals who have recently joined our party, uh, civil society, experienced uh, politicians to contest, uh, like in the case of Karim Ganj. Even in the case of Karbiang Long, we have a very um, uh, able uh, leader, the, uh, by the name of Joram Engling. So I think we've put a fantastic list forward. It balances uh, young and experience. Um, and of course, I would always hope that more women get the chance. But again, that remains to be seen. For